hi you guys welcome back to my youtube channel today we're going to talk about how to receive free product clothing shoes whatever you need on instagram so the basics is i didn't start receiving free pr packages until i reached 10k followers and i think i reached 10k sometime last year and my first collaboration was with a swimwear brand i believe but after that it was pretty simple so the trick for me okay so let's retract before i would start sending out um branded emails i would just get prs or just people from the brands hitting me up in my email um offering a cap a collaboration why can i talk <laughs> i would just get like people hitting me up offering me collaboration my first 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 collaboration um i reached out to them because my birthday was coming up um a year ago i was turning 24 and i was super late on my birthday dress so i didn't really i didn't really want to go out to buy a birthday dress because like all the stores that i was going to was like clothes or whatever so i started hearing that brand so i was like hey you guys like um i just reached 10k on instagram like you know people actually do like me on here i get tons of likes people actually comment they show love they engage you know um i'm having this big birthday event this big birthday dinner and i would love for you guys to sponsor my birthday dress and i sent out this email to about i think five brands and they all hit me up one of my favorite brands which we have here which is meshki meshki was one of the people who actually sponsored my birthday they sent me so much items i kid you not over like 10 plus items of meshki i hope i'm saying this right you guys and thank you guys so much you guys are a blessing but they sponsored my brand i remember when i was hitting meshki up in the email i was like no they're not gonna get back to me they're such a big brand like they're not gonna want to sponsor me like i don't have like 100k like i only have 10k like oh my goodness but they reach back out to me they asked for my instagram they asked for my engagement numbers and it happened guys manifest have faith right so Meshki was, oh, why did I get so scared just now? Meshki was my first collab brand. And after that, one of the five emails that I sent out, this came after my birthday. So Shimi London here, they actually sponsored me as well. I love them so, so much. They sent me bomb shoes. I think the shoes are in here. Yep. They sent me these babies and they're so cute i love them so much and i wear these with denim but that's for a different video a different time so to what you guys really came here for the trick to getting brands to hit you up versus you hitting them up is to literally i know it sounds cliche but to just be yourself on instagram i mean i was literally at one point in time i had nowhere to go y'all but i would get dressed up i would put on cute outfits at the time i wasn't sponsored and i wasn't going out shopping either so i would just like put things together in my house i was cutting stuff up i was like putting it together and i would literally go outside and have my friends like take pictures of me around the corner around the block i had this one friend who lived across the street and i'm like girl can you take a picture of me like oh my goodness like i want to post pictures tonight and it will go like that you know so after i realized that a lot of people was commenting on my pictures and everything um i took it upon myself to actually reach out to the brand some of the brands that i reached out to was diva moda fashion couture i reached out to femme luke's i reached out to um all these swimwear brands kaya swim i reached out to shimi meshki i have so many like brands i reached out to but the point the the way that i reach out to brands i make it very friendly i don't do a whole like formal email with like big words or anything i keep it real simple i say something like hey you guys my name is ashley stewart my instagram is at ashley stewart i would love to collab with you guys um i love your brand i love what you guys stand for i think we have the same style aesthetic and i always end my email with looking forward to hearing from you because i feel like when you tell someone looking forward to hearing from you you kind of like it's kind of passive aggressive like you kind of tell them like yo you better hit me back <laughs> so i always end it with looking forward to hearing from you 
so i'll write the email i send it out i send it out to about five different people and they will all literally they maybe because i manifest so well and i really believe that good things come to me they will all just hit me back and they'll just ask like they'll either be like hey we'll love to work with you like i love your instagram page i love your instagram account or they'll say something like hey send us your instagram analytics and i don't mind doing that you know so they would do that and the class would start so i true this is loud truck outside that's like a music bus <laughs> like a whole music bus outside anyways you guys so i would send the emails out they'll get back to me i'll start the collab and it literally started from there so one collab turned into two so like i said when i first started with meshki Meshki actually gave me the blueprint for all the brands because Meshki is such a big brand. So when someone sees that you work with Meshki, they're like, oh, we want to have her on our PR list and on, on our team. And then when Shimi came through with the get up, it was like, boom, boom, boom. So I started posting both of these. And remember, I had like 10 outfits from them. I had a couple things from them. And I will always post and like whenever I'll email the company that I want to work with, I'll like, hey, check out my Instagram page or like, I'll say I just worked with Shimi London. It's kind of like your model resume, but for Instagram. So I'll say like, hey, I just worked with Shimi London on a collaboration. I just worked with Meshki. I just worked with Femme Luz. I just worked with Diva Moda. I just worked with, you know, all these different brands. And they would just get back to me. So the trick to how to get free items on Instagram. It's not really a cheat code, you guys. It's literally just building your Instagram. I ha I know Instagram pages who are below 5K and they have they get promotions, you know? It's all about finding your niche. I have friends who have 2K and they get sponsored from beauty brands, you know what I mean? I don't do beauty brands because that's not my niche. Um, I'm not a person who wants to do hair products or anything like that, but what I'm trying to say is that there's always a section for you. There's always a category for you to thrive in. You know what I mean? For me, mine came in fashion and fashion was my niche. So, um, yeah, that's just the, the lane that I decided to go on. Um, so, yeah, be yourself. Work on your, I don't want to say work on your Instagram account because that doesn't matter. The numbers really don't matter unless you're dealing with like a brand who are kind of superficial. But at the same time, I feel like... It doesn't matter how many followers you have it's based on your engagement you know what i mean like you can have 10k followers and only get 10 comments on a post you know what i mean like they want to see that people are engaging with you they want to see that people actually like what you post and i think guys thank you for actually commenting on all my photos like you guys always show me so much love and um i always want to respond to all of them but sometimes i just rather like put like one comment like thank you guys for all your love or whatever but yeah the goal is to just focus on your own account um start looking at brands that you really like um <sighs> why am i out of breath yeah start looking at brands that you really like um write your emails out and just send your pitch like not really a pitch like i said keep it real casual well that works for me other people may actually want you to write like a whole email like i also have friends who have like a whole brand setup like they have like a resume they have like a what is that thing called like a treatment that they send out brands i have one friend skyla marcia shout out to you sky she's so inspiring she's actually a travel blogger um and her and her boyfriend they actually make whole pitches they send them out and all of their trips are sponsored by the brand for me i'm more so into fashion so a lot of fashion brands um respond to me lingerie bluebell um bluebell actually reached out to bluebell like a year ago and um we just did a collab and from that one collab they i became a partner with them and i've been with them ever since i just shot a campaign for them and i love them so much so just like you just have to take that not really a risk but it's not really a risk that you're taking but you just have to have confidence in yourself and really take yourself seriously you know what i mean I'm gonna keep it a bug with y'all. If y'all can see that rack back there, everything on that rack has not came out of my pocket. Everything on the rack, everything, all of my shoes have not came out of my pocket unless I'm buying like Chanel or like Louis Vuitton or something like that. Um, It comes out of my pocket, but for the most part, like I don't shop for clothing. Gifts, gifts. <laughs> 
donations, donations, gifts, gifts, more gifts. <laughs> donations, honey. But no, all jokes aside, um, I'm very blessed that I've gotten to this point where I can promote clothing and also have it in my closet where I get to save money and not have to spend necessarily um because we're young I'm only 25 and I can't just be out here spending my money on clothing you know what I mean so it's like to have brands believe in you and to send it to you and believe in your content is amazing so to wrap this video up these are also um sent to me everything that I have is literally sent to me and i love it so much because i i like to look at my closet and be like oh that's when i did that collab it's kind of like i said having a resume so these are my favorites like i told you guys before um yeah these are actually my favorite um gifts <laughs> so yeah so back to wrap this video up five tips for getting free things on instagram one Focus on your own content. It doesn't matter if you have 10K, 2K, or 50 followers. Second is to find out your niche. Are you into beauty? Are you into swimwear? Are you into fitness? Are you into fashion? Two. Number three, look for the brands that you feel supports your, your image. Don't just hit random brands up and like because you want free things. That's not the way to go. Number four send out your email make it friendly don't do too much don't add like big words or anything and number five just have confidence in yourself and remember that you are that right so <laughs> i hope this video has helped you guys with um just knowing how oh that's my voice sound like that i hope this video has helped you guys at least a little bit with instagram products and free things and yeah thank you guys for watching my videos and i hope you all have a good quarantine and i will see you guys later bye